I believe it on Black Tree TV. Huh? Yeah. We roll in. Uh, roll it. Uh -huh. All right, awesome. Okay, strike it, strike it, work, work, Vogue, Vogue, all the mood, all the moods. Patrick Stark, you just gave me all the moods and more feels. I don't even know what I'm feeling right now. I need to know the inspiration for this outfit. It is absolutely gorgeous. It's such a mood. You stand out right when you walked out. All eyes are on you in the best way. Tell me where this inspiration comes from. Girl, I, we are in October. I am serving PSL, pumpkin spice latte, my white girl vibes. I'm actually wearing Uggs under this dress. Um, I, I just love orange. I try to wear a color that I haven't worn, so I'm trying to run the gambit of Roy G. Biv, the rainbow, so I haven't worn orange, and, and I love this color. And you're huge in the makeup, beauty, you know, style community. What are the trends that you've picked up on just being on this carpet? Is there anything that you think is going to be huge or big? Yes, I feel like, you know, when you go to these music events, I feel like color is, you know, no one holds back on color. So I feel like, you know, beyond like the Oscars or the Critics' Choice or the Golden Globes, everyone is more tailored and reserved. Whereas like at the Grammys, American Music, Billboard Awards, everyone wants to wear color. And you're seeing a lot of that on the carpet today. Color just shines on people. It shines on you. You look amazing. I mean, you just recently worked with Karuchi Tran on the, you know, making Tiana black again, and it was huge for a lot of people. Um, with that sort of campaign, what? Was, how did you decide to do that sort of idea? What What was the inspiration behind it? And what was it like working with her? Three part question. <laughs> yeah, no, Karuchi Tran is such an amazing woman. She has uh, collabs with ColourPop that are already online. She's coming out with more, and it was just a, such an organic partnership to work with ColourPop. I have never worked with her or ColourPop. So to transform such a beauty into a living princess and to celebrate diversity that uh, makeup is a one-size-fits-all and that any any woman, any color, any person, even boy or girl can live their princess queen fantasy. Yeah. And you know, you even touched a little bit on like anybody can live their fantasy. Anybody should be able to, you know, be who they want to be. In our political climate at a time like this, what would you say to all you know all of your fans who you know feel like the government doesn't really support them right now be it women be it people of color be it the lgbtq community what would you want to say to them right now I think there is so much that we can do with our voice, but actions speak louder than the words. Go ahead and vote. Make a difference. Show support to who, who, who you want to be in office. And yeah, let's make a world of a difference.